Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Sampurasun Hello nice people there And welcome back to our Unitalk program Here at Strabis TV And for today edition I am Ian You still know me right? I am Ian English We'll be with you until the end of the sessions But for sure I'm not alone Because we have already guest coming studio Don't you know him? He is a very talented man. He is a person. He is a man with a bunch of certificate and experiences, you know. So just let's investigate him anyway. Right. Hello. Hello, Ian. Right. So, uh, could I have your name, please? Yeah. My name is uh, Alguska. Or right. People well, used to call me Alka. Well, by the way, and it's nice to see you here at the studio. It's really great to be here. It's my right. pleasure. And anyway, for uh, thank you for our unit talk. Mm -hmm. And. It's really great honor and right. really great opportunity to be here. Right, and so you are better known as Alka. Alka, and most of my clients address me as a coach Alka mm -hmm. because they know me as a coach in my profession. Wow. So, that's so coach Alka. It is. Right. <laughs> <laughs> well, all right. Um, here we're talking more about uh, one, one of the program. It's been really popular, right? Mm -hmm. Not just in Indonesia for sure, because from the name we know, NLP, NLP, exactly. it's been popular. Exactly. It's, That's right. I do believe it's not even made in Bandung, right? Mm -hmm. Made in Garut. No, of course not. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, tell us more who actually you are mm -hmm. and uh, what is actually an NLP. Right. I, I'm, okay. I'm actually, what is it, uh, wondering why. Okay, right. why many famous people use NLP perhaps. Yes. Great. So uh, again, my name is Alka and I'm a professional coach. And basically, I am utilizing NLP in my professional coaching services. Mm -hmm. And some people are wondering what NLP is about and how it can be so famous. Mm -hmm. So to start off, perhaps I will tell some stories about as a coach, what things that I do for my client. Mm -hmm. As a professional coach, basically, I'm helping my clients to get uh, to the point that they want or I can use to say uh, the desired state. So they are in certain state right now and they want to achieve some kind of achievement. It can be in personal development, career, it can be in business or whatever it is. Mm -hmm. So they know that they have some blind spot or they know that they have some limitation in what they are doing and how they think, how they perceive. So in most cases, even many executives out there in overseas like Bill Gates, like uh, Tiger Woods, they have been using coach for many times. So uh, again, in my profession as a coach, I'm helping my client to get their goals by uh, using some specific coaching techniques and in that technique, one of the techniques that I always use is NLP. So basically, NLP stands for Neuro Linguistic Programming. It's a really abbreviation. Mm -hmm. And again, as you mentioned, it's not from Bandung, it's not from Garut, of course. <laughs> of course, right? <laughs> I was kidding at that time, right? right? <laughs> so NLP was originated from uh, US. Mm -hmm. So it's uh, it's actually, actually, there are some people who uh, who are recognized right now as the founder of NLP. Right. But there are two people who are actually uh, more popular rather than the others, and those are Richard Bandler and John Grinder. So right. they found NLP through some series of experiments. Basically, mm -hmm. NLP is about how we can be excellent person or how we can adapt the pattern of excellence in our life. Mm -hmm. This is one of the good things in NLP. If others or if someone can do specific things, and they are good at it, NLP can be used to model or to copy that strategy and right. we can adapt that to our life. So we can, in quote and quote, we can copy other people's strategy of success right. and use it for our personal benefit. So again, in a coaching session, what, they, uh, what my client wants, they want to achieve some specific goals in their life. So what I can use with NLP is I can explore their inner resources their belief system, their identity, their value, and I help them to align. Well, I help them because it's not me who do it, it's them. I just help them to align all those things into one good alignment so they know that actually they are operating one pattern of excellence which can help them to achieve their goal. 
Wow. That, that's what coaching is about and that's how I use NLP in my coaching session basically. Right, 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 right. From the way you early mentioned it about NLP, it seems to me that you are actually the man with with a um, big of experiences about it. All right. <laughs> so how did you learn about NLP anyway? Okay, then, then. And why should be NLP for you to learn? Okay, that's really <laughs> great questions. Thank you. I actually, I, I came up to NLP about six years ago, and it's uh, perhaps some people say it's coincidence, where, mm -hmm. where where I personally don't believe about coincidence. I believe yeah. that everything has been arranged. Mm -hmm. So uh, the first thing I learned was actually not NLP. The first thing I learned with hypnosis before I learned right. hypnosis and hypnotherapy. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I I was wondering about. Uh, about the, the about the mindset, about the paradigm. So that time I read so many books, so many literatures, and right. finally I came across the hypnosis and hypnotherapy. I learned about those two subjects in depth, and after some some times, I started to ask myself that I want to know more about this because hypnosis, hypnotherapy always mentions about NLP and NLP. Right. Finally, I have time that I learned NLP from the book reference literatures until finally I learned NLP in my first practitioner program. By the way, NLP has uh, several levels for those who learn in it. Right. For those who start their journey, mm -hmm. they are uh, known as practitioner level. So I started my practitioner level there and finally I kept learning and learning until finally I got the master practitioner level, the coach level, NLP coach level mm -hmm. and to get the NLP trainers level. So NLP, why do I learn NLP? Because I do really believe that people really have resources what they need to perform. Right. And NLP help us to explore that resources and really adapt that into their pattern of excellence. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's what we can have all about NLP. Not all actually, because I think um, Coach Alka just mentioned it in, the, in a short uh, in a in a in a shot, right? Right. So uh, nice people there. We still have actually so many things to talk, especially related to NLP. But since this episode, we just talk about NLP in general. That's what we have for this episode. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you again to the next episode. And bye bye.